Okay guys, so we're just going to do a quick video on how to replace a leg on the Mavic Pro. Um, due to a first day uh, accident on my Mavic, I crashed it into a wall. Um, only at a very slow speed, but it was enough to um, crack the leg uh, just below the screw, um, which was kind of getting worse and it would have eventually kind of destroyed the leg. Um, it was feeling a bit sorry for itself. It was kind of bending down on one side. So um, I got in contact with Salvage Drone in the US. Um, Jeff uh, kindly sent me a replacement. It took a week to arrive into the UK. Um, I've already replaced it. Um, but I'm gonna do this video to show you guys how I did that. Um, it's very easy. It's like a 10 minute job. Uh, and I'm very happy with the result. Uh, so, Let's get started. Okay guys, so what you're gonna need for this um, is maybe some tweezers um, and a T6 uh, a Torx screwdriver. Um, what you need to do is pull out the offending arm and you're gonna have uh, one, two, three Torx screws uh, underneath. Uh, what we'll do, we'll just undo those now. What you want to do, you want to hold the motor while you're doing this um, and kind of lift up while pushing down because these screws are very fragile. You do not want to round them off, um, but they're quite tight as well. So just put a good amount of pressure in there and, uh, and just get those unscrewed. Keep them to one side because you do not want to be losing these. So once all the screws are out, you can wiggle the arm a little bit depending on how damaged yours is. And just be careful not to pull it because inside you have the um, antenna board that's uh, how the Mavic gets its signal from your controller. Um, and that has a little bit of silicone on it um, to hold it in place. So we're just going to move that silicone out of the way. And what will happen is our, our antenna board will slide out of the leg like that. Now I advise strongly against putting any glue anywhere near this leg because I did um, and I had a little bit of glue run down the leg when I tried to um, stop it from cracking anymore. The tiniest little bit of super glue got inside the leg and stuck it to my damaged one. So I had a really hard time about an hour trying to remove it so keep glue away from the leg um, get your replacement line it up with the two little grooves you'll see inside here just be very careful push it all the way down if you've got any silicone, uh, I would advise if you put a little bit there, like I have, mine's still got to set. Um, it will just keep it in place um, when you're flying. Uh, it's not going to go anywhere, but you know that's what DJI do, so we might as well. There's a little groove uh, for the antenna cable. If you just push the antenna cable back into that, and we shall push the leg back into place like so just make sure it's neatly in there and then we can go about screwing it in same thing pull up on the uh, motor and apply a nice amount of pressure into the screw um, do not round these off, but do it tight. I wouldn't know where you'd be getting replacements for these screws from. That would be very difficult. So I'd like to say a big thanks to Jeff at Salvage Drone because finding these uh, 
you know, spare parts on such a new drone. As it stands, DJI don't even sell any spare parts for the drone um, at the moment. I know if you go on their website, they have stuff for the Phantom, but nothing for the Mavic. Um, I'd also suggest uh, DJI Care if you've yet to get, uh, receive your drone or you've got uh, you're still within the first 48 hours, you can get DJI Care for $99 or 99 pounds. And if you damage your drone, you can send it to DJI for a replacement. But that's it. That's the replacement leg. As you can see, nicely fitted. And the drone, back to normal. Thank you for watching.